Hey guys, here we are again in towns, in our little village. Uh, well, more of a an area laid out with some trees and some wheat. But we're 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 doing well. We're doing well. I I, I we could be, we could be doing worse. So we have uh, Mu Riel bringing some apples and stuff. This was our uh, I, I believe we were doing an emergency haul of food. And just bringing it down into ah, they're bringing it down into the dining hall to eat it. So that that's lovely. Uh, they're also getting the stone. Get that stone in there and all that good stuff. I'm considering the usefulness of doors here because it. I don't know. Tell me if you want doors there, because I kind of want to put them down, but. Would they be useful? Would they be necessary? I need to get more of these. These are just amazing. And then, once we get this organized, like this is going to be huge when it's done. It's just going to be a giant square of loveliness. And we need to make sure we don't break into the bakery, because that'll, that'll be awful. And he's just got some raw chicken. Eating some raw chicken, just casually as you do. And the wheat fields are ready for harvest, and Sydney, Sydney's getting that wheat. She should be... Oh, no. Oh, okay. Turning it into flour. And then going down to make it. Okay. Um, I saw on someone else's video that uh, 10 maybe is a bit too much. Let's, let's lower that down to 5, and then they will always have at least 5. So once someone eats it, they won't need to... We won't need to have it at 10, because... Ten's too much. They're not going to be able to make ten at a time. But if we have it at five, then they'll always make one. Oh, people are hungry. It's not good. Most people got their apples and stuff, but uh, we're, we're we're definitely having to start pumping out the bread. Where are the prepared food barrels? We were going to put some. Oh yes, we were going to put those in the dining room. So uh, Earl is hungry. But he's still working away. Um, this isn't great, so let's just cancel these orders right here because we want all this. We want all this wheat going into bread production. So let's put a game speed three. Getting the walls complete. We won't cancel that yet because people are people are still making bread. There's Jerry. He was he was he's in the. That was his reward for putting that. And here's John. John de Beville. Making some bread for himself. And here's uh, Gregory. Gregory House making some lovely stone walls. And then he'll get himself something. There's, uh, there's. Hold on. Did Earl not. Never mind. He's hungry again if, if he wasn't before. And he's just harvesting the wheat now. So th this is fully functional. It's working well. So we've got a decent food output. We've got renewable wood. And in case that fails us, this. Fat ass jungle over here. And then the big orchard here. Some wheat hidden behind there. But we shouldn't we shouldn't need that. Our uh, farm should be let's just let's just harvest this anyway, because we can always turn that into thing on its own. We can always turn that into flour, I believe. Still making the stone walls. So this is working quite well. I've had playthroughs. Well I've had uh I've had towns where people just don't listen to what you say. Let's just cancel this so that no one accidentally cuts off the corner. Like they did here! We'll just have to see what happens. Uh, most people are sleeping and getting their food, but once they get their food they should be should be ready for some more work. There's a chicken and a pig. We, we really need to get some animal farms going. Uh, I think we'll have the animal farms here. We want our central hub of food to be around this area because the dining hall's here. So if we have, we could have our tree orchard here, our fruit tree orchard there, and then animal farm here, and then the bakery's underground. We can have the kitchen underground as well, actually. There's fourth wind, les jumelles. This is a French town or something. De Musel. Dauphy. Yeah, this is French. Les Jumelles. De Biville. Quecusu. 
de Kuthi. Kuthi? I don't know. But we have lovely planted trees. We're, we're, we're doing well. Uh, there's John just taking a nap in the middle of the wheat fields. But that's okay. We'll forgive him for that. So we have people. We're, we're on the precipice of starvation. But they're still getting the still getting the walls pumping out. We're almost oh okay that he he did that anyway okay. They can get diagonals good to know. So yeah and that's filled in okay good. Dining room's shaping up nicely. I do much prefer this these walls to those. Those are those those are too tall. I mean I might use them in some places but to be honest I prefer these. And you can, you can color them in. What I don't understand is, I know the description from this comes from the blue gel, but what if you use blue flowers? Why would it vibrate? It's not gel. Gel engraved blue. I don't know. Shouldn't judge them too heavily on that. I was told that these make nice warehouse looking walls. I'll have to try that out at some point. Maybe down over here. Once we get this expanded. Let's let's dig out a little bit more. In fact, let's, let's, let's not. I want to complete the dining room before we do any more. Where's our mine? I'm sure we had a mine somewhere. Or was that? Oh, that must be one of the previous, one of my previous games. I'm considering making the mine in here, because that would be convenient. Because you mine the resources and then put it up. And by mine, I mean like dig down another layer. We'll do, we'll do that now. There's there's Adelaide doing it instantaneously. Which is always good. So let's get this ladder planted down there. Our personal rooms are probably going to branch off from the dining room because... Oh, there's, there's Sydney. Starving to death. Horribly. Oh, sorry. Just need to... And we're back. Sorry about that. Um... I should probably disable the mud because the mud's kind of useless. I might have one barrel dedicated to mud just because it's like the outcast barrel. That was so much easier in the older versions. Admittedly, this is organized, but when you need to do mass amounts. See if this is one I've already done. No, it's not. When you have to do mass amounts, this really gets in, in your way. The fact, the fact that it's so organized gets in your way. I should probably be doing this while paused, but... Is this the one I just disabled? No, it's not. Right, we'll know later on if that's one of the ones. No one's making this barrel. Probably because we don't have any wood. Let's make this... Let's make this useful. Now, I'm hoping that these... I don't have to replant these every time and they'll automatically replant themselves. Yes, they will. That is amazing. Good. That's good to know. So we've got um, our raw food barrels aren't being put to use at all because people are only harvesting the wheat whenever they're hungry. But you know, there's no problem with that. That's all right. We've got some bread lying out in the middle of nowhere, and Jury just picks it up and goes to eat it. Let's get a barrel in here. Just for bread. Shouldn't need more than one because if we're only stockpiling five at a time, ten, a barrel of ten should be able to hold it. No one's made the mud thing yet. We, sh we should, we'll probably be able to get rid of this at some point and just slowly expand the barrels. Ah, there we go. Minus container, disable all. Minus container, which. No, no, no. 
materials, enable mud. And then all the excess mud can just, in fact, no, we only need one. I doubt we're ever going to need more than ten mud. What? Uh, oh, oh, no, no. Adelaide's dead. Thought that was a dungeon. Oh, wow. No, don't. Yeah, she's dead. Oh, God. Yeah, she's. Wow. Um. Why is she. She's dead now. Eh? No. Not now. Jesus. Oh god. She she killed three. She killed two spiders and a slime. That's that's pretty impressive. I have to admit. Um. Let's just make sure they're not gonna be. Just as a precaution. I thought it was suspicious the way that they were. The way that it was pre dug. That was. That was bad. Need to never, ever do that again. Uh, there's Muriel starving to death and still. still getting the dirt over there. I've got weed. Ready for. Right, okay. Now that basically everyone's fed, I might, might as well start getting the orders back to plant the wheat. And just as I say that, three people demand food. Okay. There's John planting some more wheat. Benefit of this, at least, is that they won't starve to death by the time this harvest, so we'll get to overkill their hunger. Just I thought he was hugging a chicken there. In fact, yeah, go ahead. Kill that. If you can catch it. Just holding it upside down. And. Oh god. Holding it upside. Oh dear. Yeah, I don't want any stink clothes. This, uh. This isn't going well. Um, I thought. Oh, um. See, I thought, I thought we were doing well for a while. Uh, I didn't think that was gonna happen. There's a sound of everyone eating, so. Oh god. Muriel, starved to death. Workaholic, didn't didn't remember to eat. Ugh. Fourth wind was was telling her Muriel, you, you need to, you need to eat. But no, she she just she wanted to fill that barrel up with mud. She she knew that if she were oh god. She knew that if she was going to die, her dying wish was that this lovely uh, barrel would be completely filled up with wheat. Let's cancel some of those orders. We don't need all that. Oh god, I thought that was something else. Now, that's kind of a disgrace. At least Muriel killed, like, or no, at least Adelaide killed, like, three people. Muriel just decided to keel over because she forgot to eat bread. It's kind of pathetic. But no one should be starving now. Where's the j oh, it's over to the left. At some point, once we get kitted out with some stuff, we'll go over to this island and pretty much take out that forest. Because I'm pretty sure if you kill a certain number of the froggies, they don't respawn. And then you can, like, uh, build f certain farms in the jungle that you can't build anywhere else. And all that good stuff. So, we've lost two people. But, you know, you know, fair enough. Or at least we're not 
And if anyone's hungry now, they just go over here and grab an apple and then they're, they're, they're set. Got this lone cow. Oh, there's a pear in there. No, disable all. We only want bread in here. Another prepared food barrel for apples because we're going to be getting a lot of those. I think that's. No, he's probably going to be baking. Sleeping by the baker's oven. Probably nice and warm. Well, we're not doing too badly. We may have lost two people, but at least we're more solid on our food production than I, w I have been in previous things. I mean, once we get our animal farms up here, we're pretty much set. God, I'm never gonna forgive myself for this. Pure, pure Muriel. I mean, I probably should have made a grave for. I know that was Adelaide. Muriel was here. I probably should have made a grave out of those human remains rather than just destroying them imme immediately. But she didn't really deserve it. She just decided to kill over. She didn't even. I mean, she didn't even do anything, really, apart from fill a barrel with dirt, but that's not great. Hadrian. Oh, we need to we need to make him build a wall. Just for the pun. Now these once we once we have the things planted. No no, that's going straight to flour. Fair enough. And he's probably hungry anyway. Yep, he's turning into bread. We really need to get this like filled with bread at some point, but because if I set this to in fact like you know what? Set it to ten. Screw it. We'll set it to ten. We we can we can set it to ten. We're not I mean we've got it's not like in the older versions where this area would only produce one wheat. I mean we've got nine pumping out. One of these alone fills up ninety percent of the need of that order, so having four, we shouldn't run out, and I'm pretty sure that this wheat doesn't, like, decay. I'm pretty sure it doesn't do that. And if it doesn't, then we can just continually, you know, we can just wait when it's a full harvest until we need to, and then harvest out of all of it, and then wait again. Basically stockpile. So this should be slowly filling up with bread. We really are dipping into the apples. Oh, we've got one bread stockpiled already. Oh, that should be that should be apples, not pears. I hit on flat land. I really do. And I'm probably gonna make most of my houses underground, so this can all be dedicated to. We can always move our tree farm over to here. So let's make another layer of this. We'll only do, oh, that's gonna be annoying. That one block of stone, just in the way of another field. In fact, oh damn it, too late. We can move it all over one. Yep, this is this is how this is how ne necessary it is for me to have a perfectly aligned farm. 
wonder if untilling chops the tree down automatically or if it just stops the bush from being planted once it's chopped down. It'll be interesting to find out. Oh yeah, it just, it just doesn't chop it down automatically, which is good. So, I'll just get them to plant the tree. And then chop down these trees. And then, theoretically, the bushes left from these should plant into that. Theoretically, of course. So I've got some excess wheat piling, or, f yeah, wheat. Unfortunately, it's not being stored in here like it should be. I might move those containers up. Possibly. Yeah, all the bread's got... They're not hauling is the only problem. See, hauling set automatically at the lowest priority, which means generally things are a bit disorganized with in these production lines but in particular, where things generally aren't moved and they're just lying around. But if I were to move this up, it would stop other things being done until things are hauled. So really, if you're doing any big projects, you need to set this to low. But just for now, I'll set this quite high. I'll set it to three. There should be default sets of priorities. That would be cool. Like set one would be the default. Set two could be for like big jobs, so that you have hauling set quite low, and everything set quite low except for like wall construction maybe and item construction. And then you have like farming mode where they're just high priority, planting, harvesting tilling, digging, and all that stuff. That would be really cool. Oh, there's some more bread being stockpiled. We should really get some furniture down in there, but we really don't need to. So let's tell them to start planting apple trees. We've got an apple stockpiled in there for sure. And I'll just get them to harvest. See, the majority of these are pears. We'll just do them one by one. Pretty sure you can cut the apple bush in order to plant it again. Mm. That would make sense. If you could plant the apple as well as the Oh you get more Do you get more than one apple from a tree? Huh. Yeah, this weight's really, really untidy. See we're not stockpiling any food and we really need to stockpile food because if I start building personal rooms and people start coming in, then we're gonna get we're gonna get destroyed by a siege of some description. And since we have no food stockpiled, I think I read somewhere that you need to have a stockpile of food, or else the siege will destroy you. And we need to build a wall as well. We need to build a huge wall, but it's very resource intensive. You know what, that's not going to be our mine. We can build our mine out of town slightly. So our wheat fields are doing well. We have plenty of wheat. Might be time to build another mill, actually. Let's do that. Someone's digging away. Let's get a ladder over there. We're doing well. I'm liking my... Oh. I keep looking up at that and thinking that someone else is starved, but because it doesn't... Because notifications rarely actually happen. Someone's making the ladder. Jury. Jury's making the ladder. Badger. I want to make an arena at some point so that these badgers can beat the crap out of each other, but that's... That's not a necessity. That's something we want, so that's going to be a low priority. We need... Stone, we need wood and a cow. God, a cow is going to be difficult to come by. Oh no, there's one over there. Is there another cow on this island? Because we need a cow farm. And I think... Yeah. Good. I think they randomly spawn, but... You know, I wouldn't want to test the theory. In fact, now would probably be a good time to get an, an animal farm or two set up. I want them to be individual. Which one should I go for? Probably a cow farm. Cow or pig? Cow or pig? 
bacon or beef? Bacon's too salty. Sorry to bacon lovers out there, but I'm going with beef. We're gonna need to cut down a ton of trees for this. Now we'll build a lovely wooden fence. Too close to the. Okay, do we want a two gap? We'll see if we can, because I think they're one, two, three, four, one, two, three. Hmm. Oh, they're three wide, so yeah, we can fit that in. I don't think if it's ne I don't think it's necessary to have two a uh, two gap, but why not? Let's get the. Oh, wait, that's three. Damn it! There we go. Let's cancel the order here and here. Then we'll get a lovely door in each of those. So I think we're going to end it.